Smoochie Kins, welcome to this special Thanksgiving episode. In honor of the Native Americans and the pilgrims sitting down in peace and harmony for Thanksgiving, I would like to bring harmony to moccasins and oxfords in your wardrobe. The past decade has seen loads of amazing influences from the Native American culture in fashion. From beading and fringe and gorgeous suede and tough leathers to even having feathers woven in our hair. Now, I have to say that when it comes to a moccasin, it's really important that you go for authenticity. So a little platform, not gonna work. Pom-poms on your shoe, no way. Here are some options for some great authentic picks. Minnetonka moccasins are my absolute favorites. They've been around forever and I'm especially fond of these double fringe suede booties. Pair them with black skinnies and an A-line cable knit cozy sweater. Flat moccasins can be paired with your old vintage jeans or maybe a boyfriend khaki trouser and then pair it with a super cool asymmetric top and top it off with a rugged durable bag for full effect. So come spring, you can still wear your moccasins. Maybe grab a pair like Jimmy Choo's and pair it with your favorite romper or a plain, simple, sleeveless, above the knee dress. There's just three things I beg of you to consider before leaving the house in your moccasins. One, ask yourself if it does make you look shorter. If so, you might need to adjust the hem length of your pant or moccasins might not be for you. Okay, so number two, make sure that since the look is so casual, that you temper it with a really cool contemporary awesome piece so that your look is balanced. And finally, make sure that you don't go too hippy dippy on it. Try and only incorporate two or three max hippy elements to your look. Now on to Oxfords, because there's not much else from the Pilgrim style that I would recommend stealing. I am obsessed with a few styles of Oxfords, but it does depend on your body type which one is for you. If you're on the shorter side, definitely go for an amazing heel. I'm totally obsessed with House of Harlow's platforms. They're like extreme, but extremely amazing. If you want a step down from that, just go for a simple three inch chunkier heel. I love mine from Topshop. And if you want something that's flatter, I love the look of a super stiff brogue. And if you have a little bit of a chunkier heel, you'll get a little bit more lift out of it and it'll still be super comfortable. Rapetto, which actually makes beautiful dance wear shoes, make phenomenal jazz shoes that double as Oxfords and I think you'll love how comfortable they are. So what to wear with your Oxfords? Well, I love the look paired with a cuff jean, a classic belt, and a white t-shirt and fitted blazer. I hope this is a fashionable and fabulous Thanksgiving for you and that you have the most amazing time making peace with moccasins and Oxfords in your wardrobe. Stay tuned for more what to wear and don't forget to check me out at KimmyErin.com. Smooches!